Abby Newman claims the checkpoint was unconstitutional. State police say the stop was legal and Newman took it too far when she assaulted them. You can take a look at the video from the trooper's car taken here from the website Infowars.com and judge for yourself. Notice that the media wouldn't show a full screen so no one could tell what was actually happening. We'll show you what really happened. I need to know who you are. No, you don't. Yes, ma'am, I, I do. I'm not speeding. I am not intoxicated. I have given you no reason to stop me, and this irritates me. And I would be very happy to go into town and talk to the supervisor. Sir, you cannot. You cannot. This is my Step out of the vehicle. No, sir. You cannot reach into this vehicle. Sure I can. You cannot I got to know who you are. The, you do not. I, I must know who you are before you can go down the road. I have not broken any laws. I, know, I have not accused you of breaking any laws, ma'am. You ma just reached in my vehicle and opened this door. And are I, I have no idea who you are. The officer admits she's done nothing wrong, but she still must present her papers, all part of being guilty until proven innocent. I need to know who you are. Do you have a driver's you license? You just proved to me you don't have probable cause because you don't avoid Okay, shut your ignition off for me. Pardon? Turn your car off for me. Why do I have to turn Because I'm car? asking you to turn my car off. You are violating my United States constitutional rights. Any laws that go contrary to the United States Constitution are null and void, and I do not have to submit to them. I am not intoxicated. You have already stated you don't know who I am, so therefore... Uh, uh, that's I don't, the whole point. I, I don't, don't know who you are. I have told you who I am. Okay, this is an approved checking detail site. Are you going to tell me who you are? No, sir. You're not going to tell me who you, you are? You have not charged me with anything. You have not told me I've well, done anything wrong, and I do not owe you that, sir, because I don't serve you. You serve me. Okay. Because when you take one, you take another, you take another, and before all, you know it, we can't go anywhere without our papers, and that's what this is. May I see your papers, please? You can't travel down this road, ma'am, unless I show you show me your papers, please. You've already told me that the stickers are in order. I wasn't traveling in undue speed. I've done nothing wrong, and this is absolutely wrong. Don't reach inside my vehicle. I'm going to place you under arrest for obstruction of justice. What am I obstructing, sir? Sir! Step out of the car for me. Step out you of the car for me. You are physically forcing step, me step out. out of the car No, sir, don't you touch any of my personal belongings in this car. You're right. Recorded this conversation. Yes, I did. Resisting arrest. It is not a fault. I get the car. Don't you take one single item out of my vehicle, sir? I'm not fighting you. You're under arrest for resisting arrest, obstruction of justice, and assault on a police officer. I did not assault you. Think about our priorities in America. At a warrantless Fourth Amendment violating checkpoint, they pull over a housewife with no criminal records. When she simply doesn't want to get out of her car, they grab her and charge her with assaulting them. Let's take a closer look and you can judge for yourself what this thought criminal has done. Sir! Step out of the car for me. Step out you of the car for me. You are physically forcing step, me step out. Step out of the car No, sir, don't you touch any of my personal belongings in this car. You're right, I've recorded this conversation. That's yes, I did. Resisting arrest. It is not a fault. I get the car. Don't take one thing You have the right to remain vehicle. silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in court. You have a right to speak to an attorney and have him present while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire an attorney, one will be appointed to represent you without any cost to you before any questions if you desire one. Do you understand those rights as they've been read to you? Do you understand your rights as they've been read to you? They're not concerned with our borders being wide open. The tens of millions of containers coming in each year that aren't even searched. No, they're worried about a woman on the side of the road and what she's reading, what she's thinking, what she's doing. This is the first generation thought police right here in the United States. This type of activity is totally un-American. These officers should be ashamed of themselves. Oh, I want to see what their name is. Strategies of submarine warfare. Hidden agenda. Called us Man, she's into this weird crap. Power plays, ruthless.com, the bear and the dragon, Patriot Games. Here's where things really get interesting as they begin to dig through her car and find what they consider subversive material. Well, I just will get a record started. Yeah. You don't ask her, you just won't get the next one. I won't get the next one. She's invoked her right to remain silent, even though she don't believe in our laws.
even though she don't believe in our laws, no trooper, it's you that don't know our laws. You're the one that's overthrowing our Constitution, our Bill of Rights. Our country was founded on people not being stopped like criminals, like peasants are being searched. The right of the people to be secure in their persons, houses, papers, and effects against unreasonable searches and seizures shall not be violated, and no warrant shall be issued but upon probable cause. You wouldn't believe all the paraphernalia in here. I mean, look at this clipboard right here. Now, comment upon voluntary nature of Social Security. It's a whole riot act on why you're not, you don't have to have a Social Security card to pay in the Social She's Security. She's just anti-government, yeah. Uh, she apparently belongs to some kind of a uh, clan or something. Militant group. Yeah. It's uh, look, Dixon Land Law Journal, Constitution Society. I mean, all kind of compulsory production of, of documents. Anti-government, a member of the Klan for knowing our constitutional rights, for being a member of the Constitutional Society. The FBI training of our police has really paid off. I mean, this is... She's definitely studied on it, hasn't she? I'm telling you what is the truth. I, I wonder if I can keep that for any reason. Well, is it evidence of a crime? I, I, you know, if, I, if it relates know. back to her obstruction of justice, I would say yes. I mean, I think obstruction of justice is... That would be the appropriate charge. Good. Yeah. And, and that relates to it. That's why she did it. I mean, it may actually... She may be the one that would want to bring it to court. I don't know. I, I don't know either. I mean, yeah. it, it'd probably be fine reading, but I, I'm not sure if I can seize it or not. Yeah. I, know I, don't, I don't know that this is illegal. Uh, exactly. I, mean, I, you know, not, I think she can read that all she Yeah. It's not I think she can read it all she wants to. Now this, if they've actually outlawed that, that is. And I think they have. Abby Newman was vindicated by a jury of her peers and found not guilty of assault on a royal police officer and of resisting arrest. But they still tried to get her for simply invoking her constitutional rights. You heard them digging through her goods. Oh, look at pocket constitution. What are we going to do?